earth earth surface is divided into different tectonic plates when two plates collide upon each other enormous amount of energy is released results in an earthquake this causes violent shaking of ground both in vertical and horizontal direction results in loss of property and life this can be avoided by properly studying earthquake using shake table where matlab and adreno gui interface is used shake table can be excited by different frequencies shake table can also be moved by different amplitudes of same frequency shake table can also be excited in dynamic frequency such as an earthquake in this little experiment of shake table this represents different number of stories of buildings when shake table is excited with the natural frequency of fourth floor building only fourth floor building causes the motion similarly to third floor causes the motion to only to the third floor and remaining all are so called any earthquake motion can be given to the shake table such as now an el centro earthquake motion is given to the shake table now you can see how the structure behaves under an earthquake as you can see the third floor and the top floor deflect more than the bottom floors earthquake have the dynamic frequency where amplitude and frequency change with time so in an earthquake we can specifically predict which structure will going to get damaged but using central destruction method we can predict vibrations of different floors and using response spectrum method we can predict maximum deflection of a structure based upon its natural time period structural failure during an earthquake such as soft stories and ground floors with only pillars no wall torsion failure building with unsymmetric stiffness causes to induce torsion during an earthquake and causes failure Hence, disaster can be avoided by strengthening weak and frail zone in a structure. Thank you for watching.